next speaker will speak about academics, um, so I'd like to invite <laughs> Jessica Lee. to complain, um, I mean explain, <laughs> to you all the trials and tribulations they had to go through for the Ivy Diploma, which is one piece of paper, <laughs> which we receive. We receive it next year. <laughs> for IB. This is where things get interesting because if you ask any student in here, they're not going to give you a straightforward answer. So I will. Despite complaining about not getting enough sleep or having too much on our plates, every student in here chose the academic rigor of the IB program because we are passionate about learning. Truthfully, I believe that the IB curriculum offers the most comprehensive education we can receive in high school. A well-rounded education is one of the most powerful advantages we can have because it allows us to choose what we want to do in life and what kinds of people that we want to be. And IB students recognize that. Before IB, I thought, I'm only good at math. But now, after four years at Eastside, I realized how much I love the liberal arts and IB has shown me that I want to continue pursuing a liberal education. Of course, much of this had to do with the phenomenal teachers that we've had. Um, not only are they superb at their jobs, but they also go the extra mile to help us when we ask for it. To the history teachers, thank you for being some of the funniest people that we know, so we look forward to your classes. Teachers, thank you for teaching us to write so we can at least pretend to sound like we understand what we're reading in class. <laughs> <laughs> to the math teachers, thank you for dedicating your time to support me on the data and for waking up with us at 5 a.m. for competitions on the weekends. To the French and Spanish teachers, <laughs> teachers, thank you for being so, so patient with us. <laughs> and to the science teachers, thank you for challenging us to apply the knowledge that we've learned to real life. And finally, <laughs> and finally, to our IB coordinator, Dr. Schmidt, and our principal, Mr. Charbonnet, thank you for making all of this, including obtaining our diplomas, possible. We wouldn't be where we are today without the guidance of our amazing teachers. Um, however, what sets IB academics apart from other schools is also how much the students pursue knowledge outside of the classroom. I'm so proud to say that my best friend has written three novels that have yet to be published and to say I have friends who built and programmed their own drone from scratch. Um, I also have a friend who has a patent, a friend who made an app, and so many more intelligent, creative friends who have worked in labs, published research papers, taken organic chemistry, analyzed NASA data, and who even read science articles on Wikipedia, or sets and logic textbooks, or classic literature for fun. <laughs> everyone, everyone that I have just mentioned is actually sitting here in this room today, and you guys all know who you are. <laughs> and want to know the best part? The Ivy students at Eastside are so humble that you never know if you're
you're sitting in front of the next Mark Zuckerberg, or you're in the same chemistry class as the next Bill Gates, or if that shy girl in the back is going to be the next J.K. Rowling. <laughs> Every day, I'm inspired by the academic commitment of my classmates. I mean, after all, who else can finish a 4,000 word extended essay in one night? <laughs> You are all brilliant and highly capable of changing the world. I'm so honored to be among you, to call you my peers and my friends. Thank you. Woo!